the exploration of Hornville Festival Venus starts from here and this is the Naga Hirates village and it is also known as Kisama Hirates village many people uh, get confused about this these two places are the same There is again another gate. People are standing in the queue to get the entry pass here. I also need to get it. Yeah. How much for the entry fee? 20. Thanks, bro. I got my entry band now I'm ready to get inside security check-in is done now I'm ready to explore the festival venue here are some tribes just getting ready to far from their folk dance here Hi, which tribe? Oh. 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 Okay. Yes. Oh. Some VIP is coming. Oh. They're getting ready to welcome, so I'll have to walk behind them. Oh. Oh. This is which tribe? Aonaga. Oh. Aonaga. Oh. All Aonaga. There is another guy, windows to the Netherlands. They are getting ready to welcome some VIPs here. Tight, tight, place where all the programs are performed here stage there it's a very colorful chili eating competition may it's the in the 11th edition of the Hornbill festival in the year 2010 and today this competition has become a signature event of the annual Hornbill Festival. Even we can sport some Boro tribes there wearing their traditional hatter and just getting ready here. Standing in a queue. You can get to see so many artificial hornbill birds there on top. And spectators are getting ready to enjoy the various programs. Now it's time to explore different types of morungs. There are all together 17 uh, morungs this year. In earlier years, there used to be only 16, but this year one more morung is uh, added. All the major tribes of Nagas morungs are displayed here. This is a Angami morung. I'll just go and explore there. Wow. There is a common sitting place here. Even you can get to see fire in the middle.
They are founding different grains here. You can enjoy varieties of cuisines here. They have nicely prepared. Hi. Hi. Where are you from? I'm from Manchester, UK. Wow. Enjoying here? Yeah, very much so. I enjoy the friendly atmosphere. Everybody's super friendly. So you can see their kitchens. They are just displaying their kitchens. This is the Angami tribes. So many bamboo baskets on top. And even some corns are there, maize. And you can get to see meat. Wow, so nicely skinned. This is the pork. And this is the beef. And there is a fireplace in the middle of the kitchen. It is very common in uh, Nagaland and Arunachal Pradesh. Fireplace in the middle of the kitchen. Hello! Oh, hi. My campsite match here. Hi. Say hi. Hi. What are you having? Uh, I'm gonna have rice beer. Rice beer, going to have? Yeah. yeah. This is the first time I'll be having rice beer. Wow, so. enjoy. Yeah. There is also old and gun here. <laughs> and even uh, Mitun's head is displayed. This is Mitun. But not chakravati, okay? They are very nicely displaying the uh, drinks and beans. Oh, uh, midfit fermented soya beans. It's a pickles type of little spicy, you know. Okay, you can try this. This is a wild apple. This is a wild apple, and this is chips of the wild apple, and this is a wild apple. This from this wild apple. Bro, what is this called? Uh, this is rice beer. Rice beer. This is a one kind of rice beer. What do you say in your language? Juto. Juto. Okay, I'm just going to try rice beer Juto of Angami tribe. Wow. Uh, this drink was actually sponsored by George Bro. He belongs to Angami tribe from Konoma village. Very popular in Nagaland. I just wanted to know what is uh, Morung and how it used to be a function in earlier days. Can you please yes, share us? Okay. Uh, Morung is actually is a learning place, uh, very good learning place for the men, men for. Okay, and especially for the teenagers because uh, they learn the folk tunes, folk tales from the Morungs. And uh, after they walk, they come with, uh, so to say, with some, with their place, with cups with local beers and they come, they sit around the uh, fireplace and they learn from the elders. So actually a Morung is a kind of a learning place. This is a meeting place where all the bachelors come and learn the uh, folk tales, folk yes, stories, yes, uh, yes. folk songs, yes. customs and traditions from the elder people in the evening after uh, hard uh, day labor. Yes. They come and sleep there, yeah, yeah. and also at the same time, it also helps to retaliate uh, immediately at the time of emergency. Yes, because all the youths are sleeping together. Yes, yes, yes. So immediately they can uh, retaliate. Uh, so it uh, doesn't uh, it saves the time. Yes. 
if all the youths are not sleeping in one place, then you have yeah. to go door to door yes. and tell them, no, some yes, kind yes, of emergency yes. is happening. You need to wake up. Yes. So in the day, so in that way, it was helping. Yes, yes. It's not only for the bachelors. Uh, even uh, the bachelors, married, even uh, the married can yeah, come yeah. and uh, stay in this uh, place. Stay, yeah, in the, even in the stay. But to sleep is mainly for the bachelors because married people they yes. prefer. They need to sleep yeah, with yeah, their yeah, uh, yeah. wives and all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Thank you, bro, okay. uh, for sponsoring this. Oh, thank you. And thank also you. for sharing uh, wonderful information. Okay, I don't know whether I'm that informative or not, but uh, <laughs> thank you so much. Yes, thank you, bro. Now I'll explore different tribes of uh, Morung. This is Rengma Morung. Let's go inside the kitchen. This is the Rengma tribe's morum. They have also fireflies here and drying meat. Here are the vegetables they are displaying. This is the ring matrice dress for male and female. Lota Chumpu. Hello. Hello. How are you? Fine. I'm just exploring your morung. Okay. You are cooking here? Yes. We are cooking uh, this is pork. Smoke pork. Smoke pork. Yeah. <laughs> You're drying meat? Yes. Only pork you have? Huh? Only pork? No, no we have chicken we have. fish, oh, okay. river fish also we have. Both uh, dry and fresh. This is the Lota tribes, Morung. And you can see the uh, traditional out there. I'll just show you properly now. They're looking very gorgeous. Thank you. Hi. Hi. Oh, really? Yeah. What's your name, bro? Uh, this is Sade Sachiroi. Sachiroi. Where are you from? I'm from Kolkata. Wow. Actually, when... you're from Assam, right? Yes, yes, okay, yes. Okay, okay. Yeah. When did you come? Uh, yesterday. Yesterday. So we have a plan to, uh, to go to Zuku and yes. this one. So enjoying? Yeah. Ah, thank uh, you so much. Yes, yeah, sure, sure, sure. One of my subscribers from Kolkata. Yeah. <laughs> He's enjoying here in Pondville. Thanks, man. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Enjoy. Time. Yeah, yeah. Enjoy. Enjoy. Yeah. This is our morong. Our morong. House. Our house. Okay. Yeah. Thank you for the information. Okay. I'll just uh, go and explore the dormitory now. Wow. She's even weaving. So beautiful. That's what you're wearing, right? Yeah. Wow. This is really very expert, very fast. I'll just explore their dormitory. Hello. Hi. How are you? Fine, thank you. Fine, thank you. Wow, this is right here. And what meat is this? Beef? Mitun? Mitun. And here is the fireplace. You have a channel on YouTube, no? Yes, you follow me? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ah, what is your name, sir? Lima. Lima? Yeah. Uh, where are you from? Lima. 
Kohima? Yeah. You belong to Wistri? Oh. 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 Originally yeah. from Mokokchung. Mokokchung, I have a story here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, thank you. And there are so many uh, cones here. 